Chef Buck here, and uh, you can tell from the sound of the whistling pot that it's coffee time. And I've got uh, Sabrina, the coffee barista here, who's going to show us how to professionally, or she's going to instruct me how to professionally make uh, coffee with the Neo Flair handcrafted espresso. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what this is. And look at this fancy, fancy contraption here. Now this is going to take us all of not very much time, but it's quite elaborate to make a shot of espresso, which is going to be like, what are we going to end up with? One ounce of Never dark ounce. something or whatever, but we're going to make a delicious Americano. Since we're making an espresso shot, we're going to use an espresso roast. The pine grind. A little bit. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You got to weigh your coffee because this is coffee in the future. So this is a professional coffee scale. Mm -hmm. yeah. You turn it on. What did you call that? That's the power button. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's it. You can tell she is a coffee professional. And you've got this set for grams. Yes. Okay. And then you tear it. You tear it. That's the word I was looking for. Awesome. What does that mean, tear it? You just bring it to zero. Bring it to zero. Um, and we want to get this to 11 or 12 grams. You got a steady hand there, so I can see you've done this about five million times. Give or take. Cause you, cause how long did you work in a coffee shop? Too long to count. Too long, Too long to, to count. count. <laughs> Alrighty, so we got it on 11 there. So you're giving it a shake, shake, leveling it out. Mm -hmm. Just so you can take your handy dandy little funnel off there. Or you're going to leave the I'm funnel on? on? Okay. And then you're going to gently tamp it down. You don't need to put any elbow grease into that. Not really. too much. Not, Not too, too much. Because you want it to be loose enough for the water to pass through. Correct. Okay. So now we've got our ground coffee ready. All righty. The little handy dandy filter. Now we've got it in there in the shotgun. And this is for the hot water. And there is a, a kind of a, you can just barely make it out there, a little line in there, and you want to fill it up to that line. Oh, this is a great shot. This, is, this looks like some Ridley Scott action going on here. So this thing here, so you take the thing, and then you put on the other, the thing. other thing. Okay, and now you've got this lever set up here. What are you going to do? Uh, get my cup. Ready? Yes. All right. For All the flair, right. for the Neo Flair Espresso Handcrafted Espresso 5000. So the idea is just gently but consistently. Yes. That's how a good marriage works too. Oh no, sometimes hitting over the head with a frying pan is the way to go. Ooh, That's a, okay. You're a true southern lady. Yes. I don't know, that sounds like delicious coffee or my grandpa. <laughs> Could be either which one. So you just hold it down until the water starts to glub, glub, glub. And that's it. And then that is it completely. And. Oh, look at that. The drinks. Now look at that. Mm. You know what? It's too bad you didn't put it in the clear glass that she uses. Because it is a beautiful color and it's not bitter. Yeah, but I'm, I'm putting this in here because this is. An Americano. But I'm going to be drinking out of it. And we're going to do an right. Americano. And Americano, all that is, mm -hmm. is coffee, just an espresso shot with hot water added. And you add as much water as you like for the strength of the coffee you desire. And you overdid it, didn't he, Sabrina? No, 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 because I did it earlier and this is how I like it. All right, you're right. Personal and there is preference. no wrong way to make coffee. You make coffee till it tastes great to you. And then that's how you do it. But a responsible <laughs> coffee yes. includes cleanup responsibly. So I got my delicious coffee, but I got a little bit of a cleanup here. So let's go ahead and clean this up. Get down here. We just uh, pull this whole thing off. I would do it over. Uh, okay. okay. Uh, in fact, in Thank fact, you. okay. <laughs> okay. I don't, I don't know how to clean this up. So I'm going to enjoy my hot cup of coffee and we're going to let Sabrina uh, do the cleanup. Okay. Better. Alright, so, so there isn't going to be a best, although there's going to be a little bit of drippy drip, huh? A little drip, a little drip. Oh, even that looks fantastic. It, oh, just, that looks not, fantastic. It's like a goopy mess. But if you know this is the result of this great cup of coffee, or great cup of espresso. This looks like the early stages of Ebola. 
Oh. <laughs> All right. And then we just take this. Okay, so you got it. out your grounds. So just rinse it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then we're just going to rinse all the pieces off. And that's it for the cleaner? That's it. Pretty okay. easy peas. Then you just let it dry. There we go. So that's it. We got our coffee, everything's cleaned up, and now I don't know what you guys are drinking. Well, I would think Barista gets, I guess, the second cup of coffee since the first one is already being drunk. Bing! Oh, okay, I make it for the fans. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Ah, uh, sarcastic high that's five. It. That's how you make, that's how you make a coffee with the neon flare handcraft espresso. Uh, <laughs> and there will be an affiliate link down below. And uh, you can go over to Amazon.com <laughs> and uh, check out this product and see if it's for you. Let me take a, take a taste right here. That's good coffee. It's great. Now you have to make four more. Get to uh, it. Do you want to help us make some coffee? Uh, no, because today's coffee is something brand new for me. That's right. Old time coffee is what we're used to and that's what we'll end up with. Well, what did you used to make uh, coffee with? Were the instructions drawn on a cave wall? I don't know. <laughs> All right. So you're so you're, you're, I to cut this shit. Now when people go into a coffee shop and get an Americano, that's all it is. That's all it is. It's just a shot of espresso with the hot water added. That is great. This is not bitter. I've had espresso that's... Yeah, but a lot of that has to do with the beans. A lot of that has to do with your coffee. I mean, the contraption, you can have whatever contraption, but the main thing is you want to have nice coffee that you're putting in well, there. Well, and she measured it out. I think yes. our barista did us right. You should get a, a cut for that. Huh? She that's right. Like a cut. Yeah, she'll get her cut. <laughs> no, I didn't. From the company. No, no, no. no. She's going to get uh, exposure. Well, that's, that's good. That's not okay. a pleasure. Are y'all? Okay. Show yeah. them. Show huh? them. Huh? Are you going to be a productive part of this video? Not productive, no. Okay. You didn't even comb your hair. I love it. Uh, it's hurricane no, no, hair. No. It's We're hurricane gonna, hair. Yeah. Oh, I oh. forgot. Thanks I was going to say, come Sabrina, on. The uh, coffee professional for allowing us uh, to use her uh, Flare 5000. And scale, just all of it. This scale, we, I don't know, I felt like we could live without that. Uh-uh. You know how many times I've made bitter coffee? The woman oh, taught I us did. things. She taught us things. Okay. Thanks. And, okay.